Hello and welcome to traders and investors. I'm glad to present you the daily market review prepared by analysts and experts from FX.su portal. Here we go. Today is September 14 and we're starting from Euro dollar pair with Petar Yukimovic. EURUSD has been trading sideways at the price of 1.0740 in front of the ECB press conference today. There is a chance for the breakout mode. Due to the downside short-term trend and consolidation in the last few days, Petar sees potential for the further downside breakout of the support at 1.0700. In case of a breakout of the support downside objective is set at the price of 1.0650. MACD oscillator is showing lack of buying power, which is a sign that sellers may take control. Key resistance is set at the price of 1.0770. The next stage of our review is the next major. GBP USD, Sebastian Seliga describes. The GBP USD pair has been moving higher on H4 timeframe chart, despite the fact the bulls got rejected from the level of 1.2546 multiple times. The market still trades below the short term trend line resistance, so any sustained violation of the short-term support seen at the level of 1.2433 will extend the drop lower towards the level of 1.2393 and 1.2377. The intraday technical resistance is set at the price at the level of 1.2546. And the intraday technical support is seen at the level of 1.2450. The weak and negative momentum on the H4 timeframe chart support the short-term bearish outlook for GBP, as the bulls are not that strong to trigger and sustain the rally. Let's trade with the MACD indicator. Jakub Nowak would help in us. USD JPY currency pair. Here it is. For long positions, buy when the price hits 147.33 and take profit at the price of 147.65. Growth will occur if upcoming US reports exceed expectations. However, when buying, Ensure that the MACD line is above zero, or just starts to rise from it. Also consider buying USD JPY after two consecutive price tests of 147.03, but the MACD line should be in an oversold area this time, as only by that will the market reverse to 147.23 and 147.65. For short positions, sell when the price reach 147.03 and take profit at the price of 146.70. Pressure will increase in the event of another drop in US inflation. However, when selling, ensure that the MACD line is below zero, or it's just starting to drop down from it. Also consider selling USD JPY after two consecutive price tests of 147.23, but the MACD line should be in the overbought area this time. As only by that, Will the market reverse to 147.03 and 146.70?
Now it's time for Benjamin and Looney. USD CAD currency pair. Area of Markmore presents. On its four hour chart of Looney, the chart shows that the decline that occurred in this commodity currency pair is stuck at the level of the bullish fair value gap. Cyan box. And it is starting to weaken which is indicated by the TTM squeeze and momentum indicator, which has changed momentum, change color, so that over time in the near future, as long as there is no continuation of the weakening until it passes below the 1.3495, USDCAD has the potential to reverse direction to rally upwards to test the 1.3587. And if this level is successfully penetrated above, the 1.3695 level will be the next target to be aimed at. And finally, here's Laurie Bailey with AUD USD pair focused. Let's have a look. From a technical perspective, yesterday told us quite a lot about the short-term outlook for the Australian dollar. With an extended lower shadow, the price touched the support level at 0 0.6388. Afterwards, it started to gain momentum this morning. Already testing the nearest peak from September 11th. The signal line of the Marlin oscillator has started to rise further. If this slope continues, the price may surpass the resistance of the MACD line 0 0.6534 and A for the resistance at 0 0.6576, April 28th low. On the 4 hour chart, there has been a discharge, release of tension of the Marlin oscillator, green arrow. And a new upward wave is now developing, likely into the overbought territory. The price has breached the resistance of MACD line, momentarily dripping below it. The pair is experiencing an uptrend. That's all for today. See you online soon and good luck.